Vernier Caliper vs. Micrometer Tools that help with the measurement exist in various kinds, and most of them become useful for people in their daily lives. But some such instruments that become accurate for experiments or educational purposes are more complicated than others when it comes to usage. The main difference between them is that a vernier caliper gets defined as a tool that helps with the measuring of internal and external distances to extreme precision. On the other hand, a micrometer gets set as a gauge that measures small distances or thicknesses between its two faces, one of which can get moved away from or towards the other by turning a screw with an excellent thread. What is Vernier Caliper? It gets defined as a tool that helps with the measuring of internal and external distances to extreme precision. A measuring instrument comprising an L-molded edge with a vertical scale along its more drawn-out arm and an L-formed sliding connection with a vernier, used to peruse straightforwardly the measurement of a question spoke to by the division between the internal or external edges of the two shorter arms. These devices become available within the scientific world as two forms. The digital and manual version, the first one requires a small battery and costs much more than the manual one. The latter still maintains its importance within the scope as it becomes available at little cost and does not require any accessories. The upper and lower jaws become the most important parts of the device. The lower jaw helps to keep the object firmly within grip whereas the other jaw contributes to moving with the measurement. The upper jaw looks smaller in size and attached to the top location of the caliper, it can move without any problems. Depth rod measures the size of holes and steps whereas the main scale helps with the measurement of the complete tool. Then comes the vernier scale that gives it the name, the smallest part but the one that helps with the full calculation up to millimeters. The thumb screw helps with the gripping of a tool for the user whereas the lock pin gives the fixed position, so the measurement stays perfect. Most of the time, it becomes useful in universities and practical examinations for finding different values to solve critical problems. What is Micrometer? It gets defined as a gauge that measures small distances or thicknesses between its two faces, one of which can get moved away from or towards the other by turning a screw with an excellent thread. A tool that helps with the measuring of small separations, edges, or questions, particularly one given the pivot of a finely strung screw, as in connection to a magnifying instrument. Just from the name, it becomes apparent that the measurement ranges up to the microscope in millimeters and has another name of screw gauge. Places such as Europe and America now use the current term whereas most Asian countries still call it a screw gauge. Micrometer works on the straightforward guideline of changing over little separations into bigger ones by measuring the revolution of the bolt. This screw instruction encourages perusing of littler separations on a scale in the wake of intensifying them. To adjust it further, we should bring an ordinary screw with strings. While embedding a pen, the chain pivots for a specific number of times. Every turn of this screw can correspond to a comparable pivotal development, which is known as the lead or pitch of the screw. On the off chance that every one of the strings of the pin gets made with a consistent angle, which is as of now known, the measure of hub development produced can get effortlessly followed on a scale. The micrometer utilizes this guideline to gauge measurements in a proper manner. It still has many applications that become useful for people who work in industries although new instruments are getting common. Key Differences Between Vernier Caliper and Micrometer A vernier caliper gets defined as a tool that helps with the measuring of internal and external distances to extreme precision. A micrometer gets set as a gauge that measures small distances or thicknesses between its two faces, one of which can get moved away from or towards the other by turning a screw with an excellent thread. A micrometer always stays more accurate than the vernier caliper because of the mode through which the values get calculated. The primary tools used for the calculation for a vernier caliper become a sliding vernier scale to measure small changes. On the other hand, a small screw comes in handy when we calculate the readings on a micrometer. 
with one vernier caliber, people have the facilities to measure the external diameter, internal diameter, and the depth of an object. On the other hand, a micrometer may help in measuring one reading such as inner or outer diameter depending on which we use. A standard vernier caliper has a precision of 0.1 mm or 0.05 mm whereas a micrometer has an accuracy of 0.01 mm when we talk about digital calipers the reading becomes 0.01, the same as a micrometer. The cost of a micrometer stays less than that of a vernier caliper due to the nature of the apparatus. Thanks for watching.